Well, Nigel and Gabby, we just checked with Spartanburg County Sheriff's Office. As it stands, no arrests have been made, nor suspects identified in the shooting death of 22-year-old Evan Gaines. It's leaving many people here at this apartment complex and across USC Upstate campus feeling nervous. 22-year-old Evan Gaines from Columbia shot and killed last night at these off-campus apartments. According to officials, his death now being investigated as a homicide. The coroner's office says EMS responded to a call last night about one thing that upon arrival turned out to be much worse. The original call was for an individual that was injured from a fall. Uh, when they arrived, they noticed uh, the injury to the chest and the patient was still viable at the time. So EMS transported emergent to regional medical center and he was taken to uh, the emergency room and into the uh, OR and uh, passed away in OR. Tonight, students on edge. If it happened at edge and the campus apartment, I mean, likely it was a student here or someone that, that spends a lot of time at edge. And I mean, that's kind of unsettling to, to go to a school to where there's, they don't know where the shooter is or where he went. The university stresses the incident happened at an off campus location. And though the apartments may be on the edge of campus, they're not on it. Still, the proximity of the tragedy to the tight knit undergraduate community has students uneasy. There's a huge campus uh, police presence here. I mean, uh, you can't go far without seeing one. Uh, I don't feel unsafe. It's just, I mean, it's like I said, it's unsettling to have something happen so close to where I was just in class happen. Now, I spoke with a relative of Evan Gaines earlier today. She told me that Evan would have graduated this May with a business degree. Just such a tragedy. Again, the, uh, the campus is offering counseling to any students here that may need it. We're live in Spartanburg. Madeline Hackett, WIFF News 4.